Let's get back to Barga's Valley. There's a big surprise right here, so best know if you know how to play it. And this, yo, know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna unlock a mini game. So. something. Hmm? What's that now? We're looking for a white wind flower. Have you seen any near here? White wind flower? Haven't heard of it. I bet you could find one from the sky. Will you help us look? Hmm? I don't think so. I've got enough to worry about. What's in that? Look at that, will you? Some weird old something is up above my home with my dear chicks inside. I'd like to give my sweet children some food, but I can't get near the place. Looks like a time distortion. I guess time is starting to be affected in this era, too. Distortion? That's right. When Griffin disturbed the flow of time, it started to warp and become strained in places. Those... There are already lots of time distortions in my era, but it looks like they've started happening in this time, too. How can we get rid of... Whenever there's a time distortion, there's always a fragment that falls out somewhere nearby. If you hit that fragment into the distortion, you can make the distortion go away. Really? You... Well, what are you... I'll help you find... Really? Okay, Mom. It's not all that. Here, hold on. Now, where is it? There it is. This is it. This is a time distortion fragment. It's also called a sphere. Be careful. You can't touch it with your bare hands. You hit it with a long stick or something. It's not too complicated, but it's hard to get it into the distortion. We need some kind of long stick to hit. See if there's some kind of stick here. Okay, so all you gotta do is just go find the handy stick. So you're just gonna head down here. Near, near this place, and you'll find this little handy stick on the floor. Just pick it up. And you head back. And then, talk to Monica. Hey, you got one! Okay. Okay, listen up. You hit the sphere with a stick and send it flying. That's called taking a shot. Make a good shot and you'll get the sphere into the distortion. But there's one thing you've got to remember. When you hit the time distortion fragment, also called the sphere, against something, it changes color from blue to red, back to blue, like that. If the distortion is blue, you can only wipe it out with the red sphere. When the sphere and the distortion are the same color, they repel each other and it won't work. So if your sphere is the same color as the distortion, you have to hit it up against the wall or something and change the color back. It's the only way you can wipe out the distortion. We call this hitting a sphere up against a wall to change its color, bumping. You can bump the sphere as many times as you want, but the number of shots you can take are limited, so watch out. You look so serious. If you don't get the sphere into the distortion within the allotted number of shots, the sphere disappears and you fail. In my era, we call the act of wiping out time distortions like this, Sphita. Some people even play Sphita like a sport. It's golf. With the world in danger like me, but I guess people like to escape from me. That's about it? Okay. So it's pretty much kind of like golf, but it's a little more complicated than golf. You don't hit it into the hole, you hit into those time distortions. You get three shots. Equip this. And then, take the shot. Well, from here, you see that little star right, right there. Make sure that thing points there. Right there. And then just hit all the way. Ah! Crap! That's... Ah! Almost there. I guess. Ah! How's that off course? Yeah, try that again. Gotta hit up there. Yes! Oh, got it! Oh, 
my teeth. for your help. Thank you all so much. How can I ever repay you? Hey, look! What? What is it? This is it! The flower we've been looking for! I can't believe your flower would be growing on my head. Take it if that's what you need. After all, it's thanks to you that... Thank you, Mrs. Con... Well, I'm a... Oh, almost forgot. Uh, when that strange hole thingy disappeared a while ago, this fell out. It just gets in my way. Here, take it. The Swan Club. See you! It's a Speedo Club. Or a Golf Club, whatever you want to call that, but Speedo Club. It's used to, you know, that kind of... Well, you just head out. And what I am going to do is go to Cedric. For what? To get the core. Yeah, instead of running over there, let's teleport over there. Okay, well, I can't teleport next to Cedric, so I gotta run there. Plus, he's just right there. Upgrade the Rye Pod. Improve Core. Okay. And then Core 2, and then Core 3. That's all I need. And I don't need this handy stick. You can't even spectrum it anyways. I have to start it. Okay. Let's get to Eric. And make some improved bombs and sell them again. And then sell. Let's sell the energy bag. Uh, energy bag. And sell the improved bombs. And we'll sell these two. Go to back to Balance Valley. I don't feel like running over there, so. Well, see ya.